How are you today? Good. How are okay. you today? Oh, you can see me good, good. Can you hear me. All right. So, how are you today? Um, great. Not great. 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 Oh, that's good. I'm so happy to see you. All right. So, did you have a good day? Did you go to school? No. You didn't go to school? Oh, no. So, did you have classes online? Yes. Oh, okay. Very nice. Good work. Okay. Can you use your pen? Can you use your pen on the computer? Mm, yes. 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 Okay, let's see if we can do this. So, okay, mine's working. Your pen also working? Where? Um, okay, so when you, if you go here, to annotate, you see the pen, then you click on that. Uh, okay, let me see if I can show you. Um, let me see if I can show you. So, so you, you click you see, you click on this. Click on that. And then you click mm -hmm. on this one, draw. Do you see it? Yeah. And you can draw. Did you find it? So if you see this, then you click on this one. You don't see. You don't see it? Yeah. I don't see my pen. You don't see your pen, oh no. All right, let me see if I can help you. Mm. Okay, so do you... Mm. Is it freezing? All right, so you don't see this? Annotate this pen. No. Not. Are you using a laptop or iPad? Laptop. A laptop. So you should have this. So you should have this function. You should have this function. No. Not, huh? Uh, maybe you're just not finding it. You see, it's a picture of a pen. Then you have to click. You have to click on that pen. And then you have to... You have to... Um, you have to click on draw. Okay. 
Is it working? So it's yeah. if I if I share my screen with you, then you should be able to draw. I saw something happen. Did you find it? No. No? All right. All right, so you don't see it? Let me see, now I disabled it. I enabled it, do you see it? The pen, the pen. Do you? So you click on it, you click on draw. You click on pen you, and you click on draw. So, so you see, you click on this and then you click on this. And then you can draw. No. Not working. Oh, no. Okay, it's fine. We can try it next time. We can see why it doesn't want to work. All right, let's have a look at our lesson. Are you ready? Ready? Ready. Yes, let's go, go, go. Okay, so I will look how we can, I can show you next time. Lesson four, your hair looks great. Looks great. Okay, vocabulary. Beard. Mustache. Beard. Beard. Mustache. 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 Yes, good job. A lot of old men have mustaches. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> and some people have beards. <laughs> All right. Let's go, go, go. Alien. 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 Look in the mirror. Look in the mirror. Look in the mirror. Good job. Blonde. Blonde. Her hair color is blonde. 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 Blonde, yes. So instead of saying yellow, we say blonde. Curly. Curly. Oh, curly. Okay, teacher's hair is very curly. Yes. Curly. All right, here you can see curly. Straight. 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 Good job. Scary. Scary. Ah! <laughs> Scary. Scary. Ugly. Ugly. <laughs> ugly. Ugly. Okay, so I like my ugly face. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's oh, I think it's funny. All right. So very good. Let's go have a look. Okay, so structure. Relatives clause. Okay. We use relative clauses to give additional information about something without starting another sentence. So we combine sentences with a relative clause. Your text becomes more fluent 
and you can avoid repeating certain words. So we use who, which, whose, who, that. that. So for example, I told you about the woman who lives next door. Next door. Do you see the cat which is laying on the roof? No. Okay, can you give me a sentence with a relate, relative clause? No. Can you give me a sentence with a relative clause? No. So, can you give me a sentence? All right, so. Can you give me a sentence, please? Yes or no? Yes. What's your sentence? A sentence, I need a sentence. So look at the example, look at the example. So can we give our own sentence? So let me help you. Okay, so teacher will come up with a sentence. Okay, um, I told you about the boy who's in my class. Okay, so then we use this word, whose. Okay, can you give me a sentence using one of these words? Um, I, I talk about the Andy, so give me a sentence using who, which, whose, whom, or that. Come on, it's not difficult, it's not difficult. Uh, talk about... A boy who's in my my class, my school, my school. Very good. I talked about the boy who's in my school. Good. Okay, we can also say, um, we can also use this. Which, which dress is hers? Right? Is that his car? All right, so let's have a look. So we say relative pronoun. This is relative pronouns. Who? Who? Which? 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 
Which? Whose? Whose? Whom? Who? That. That. Okay. Let's have a look. So who? Subject or object pronoun for people? Read the example for us. I told you. I told you about the the men. Woman. Talk about the woman who lives next door. Good work. So I told you about the woman who lives next door. Good. Which subject or object for animals or things? Okay. Do you see the cat which is laying on the roof? Do you see the pink ruler which the teacher has in her head? Which? Which can also be referring to a whole sentence. Read for me. He couldn't. Yes, he can. He couldn't. He couldn't break with. Read. Read with. Which? Which? Surprised me. Me. Okay, come on, Andy. This is easy. Wait, you need to read. You need to focus. Okay. Pos okay, whose possession for people, animals, and things? Do you know the boy whose mother is a nurse? Please read. Do you know the boy whose Mother is a nurse. Good, very good. Good job. All right, whom? Object pronoun for people, especially in non defining relative clauses. Okay, so. For people, I was invited by the professor whom I met at the conference. I was in invited invited by the professor professor whom I met at the Conference. 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 Yes. So, okay. So this person was invited to dinner or something by a professor, teacher, and he met this teacher at the conference meeting. That subject or object for people, animals, and things. I don't like the table that stands in the kitchen. I don't like the table that stands in the kitchen. Good work. Very nice. Okay, let's have a look. Write the answers to the questions. Ah, let's go. So number two, that's... Ooh, what's this? It's a brick. Huh? A brick. Huh? A no. Brick. Uh oh. Okay, we're going back to our vocabulary. You need to remember what we read and learn. Beard. 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 
beard. Mustache. Alien. Look in the mirror. Beard. Beard. Mustache. Mustache. <laughs> Alien. Alien. Look in the mirror. Perfect. Good work. Blonde. Long. Long. Okay, so the second one. Blonde. What color what color is her hair? It's blonde. What's what's this? Number two. Beard. Beard. Good. Number three. What kind of hair has he got? Curly. Curly hair. Good. Number four. What's this? A mustache. Mustache. Good job. Number five. Is her hair long or short? Long or short? Short. Short. Six. What kind of hair has she got? Uh, his, uh, straight hair. Straight hair. Very nice. Andy, does your dad have a beard or mustache? No. no? Okay, good. Does your mom have curly hair or straight hair? Um, straight hair. Straight hair. Very nice. Good work. Talk about your hair. Okay, so I'm ready. Okay, so I have brown curly hair. What about you, Andy? Short. Uh, a black hair. I've got black hair. Is it short? Is it long? Uh, short. Okay, everything okay? You seem very tired today. <sighs> Are you tired? Short hair. Is it curly or straight? It's straight. Straight, which is straight. Can you read this for me? I've got black short hair, which is straight. I've got. I'm got. Okay. I'm got black short. Yeah, which is straight. Which is straight. Good. Okay, which girl is Kim? Let's have a listen. Four C. Your hair looks great. Listen and tick the box. One. One. Which girl is Kim? Look, Dad. Dad? Kim's playing football with the boys. Is she the girl with long blonde hair? No. Kim's got brown hair. 
And it's short, not long. C. Oh, yes. I see her. Wow. She's good. Two. Which man is Mr. Scarf? Excuse me, is that Mr. Scarf, the man with the beard? Mr. Scarf hasn't got a beard, but he's got a moustache. Oh, is that him, the man with fair hair? Yes, that's right. Blonde. Okay, Three. which one is which Mr. Scarf? Which person is... Which one is Mr. Scarf? Uh, listen again, please. Yeah. Which man is Mr. Scarf? Excuse me, is that Mr. Scarf, the man with the beard? Mr. Scarf hasn't got a beard, but he's got a moustache. Oh, is that him, the man with fair hair? Yes, that's right. Is... Which A. man is Mr. Scarf? A, B, or C? A. A. A is brown. He's got brow a brown moustache, not fair. His, his hair C. is not blonde. C. C. Good job. So fair is also blonde. Blonde. Okay. Let's listen. Three. Three. Which person is Jim's cousin? Is that your brother, Jim? The boy who's standing next to your mum? Yes, Mr. Cook. My hair is straight, but he's got curly brown hair. And who's the boy with curly fair hair? That's my cousin. Which person is Jim's cousin? Hey. B. Hmm? B. B. Good, yes. Very good. Good job. His name's John. Four. Which boy is Paul's friend? That's a good drawing, Paul. Is this you? The boy with the curly brown hair? Yes, Miss Best. And my friend Nick is in my drawing, too. But his hair is straight. The boy who's wearing glasses. Is that him? That's right. Okay, which boy is Paul's friend? Is B. B. Good job. The boy with straight black hair wearing Glasses. Very good work. Nice, Andy. Very nice. Okay. Let's read. Are you ready? Yes. Okay. Are you tired, Andy? Are you tired? Oh. Yes or no? You look so tired. Okay. Let's see. Change Hugo's face for the film. Oh, well. Hugo Top is really it, famous. Because Hugo Top is very famous because he a film star. The name of his seven. Seventh? Seven film, film is film is what best known. What's best. that noise? Be careful of the pronunciation. 
What's that noise? What's that noise? Much better. Yuko is making it now. Yuko is making it now. In this room, his body and fact look very different. Hugo is an alien. Good. Before filming? Filming, Hugo put on his orange coat. On his orange alien suit. suit. And then six down in front of a big mirror. Good. Then Alice. Alice start changing his face. His face. His face. First, First she paint is green. Paints. Paints is green. Then some more. Pen. Black line. Lines. Don't leave out the S. Lines. On his face and change. Changes. The, changes the color of his eye. Eyes. Eyes. Good. A third person. A third person call. Colic. Called. Call Matt. Oh. Adds a mustache. A mustache and bear to who will fix things. Fourth. 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 Fourth person. Persons. Changes. His sock. Straight. Blonde. Straight. Blonde. Hair to blonde. Curly. Curly purple hair. Then he will can start filming. Start filming. Start filming. Your face looks really ugly and scary now. Good. Everyone? Hey, we will look in the mirror again and loud. Loud. Laughs. Yeah. Well, I think I look really cool. He say, says, thank you. thank you. Thank you. Good job. So very good. Okay, but don't forget where you see these S's, right? Where you see all these S's, you need to pronounce them. All right. Otherwise, you lose points for reading. And it's points you could have gotten. Okay, so let me read. Then you listen. Okay. Hugo Top is really famous because he's a film star. The name of his seventh film is What's That Noise? Hugo is making it now. In this film, his body and face look very different. Hugo is an alien. Before filming, Hugo puts on his orange alien suit and then sits down in front of a big mirror. Then Alice starts changing his face. First, she paints it green. Then someone paints black lines on his face and changes the color of his eyes. A third person called Matt adds a mustache and beard to Hugo's face. And a fourth person changes his short, straight blonde hair 
to long curly purple hair. Then Hugo can start filming. Your face looks really ugly and scary now, everyone says. Then Hugo, oh, sorry, Hugo looks in the mirror again and laughs. Ha ha ha. Well, I think I look really cool, he says. Thank you. Okay, good work. Any questions? Any questions? Andy? Yes. Questions for teacher? Yes. So the first person painted his face green. The second person came and put black lines. on his face, okay? Uh, the third person put a mustache and beard on him. Okay. <laughs> a mustache and a beard on him. All right. And then they changed his hair to curly purple long hair. <laughs> okay, to make him look scary. All right, so now he looks very scary. Good job. All right, was the lesson very difficult? Was the lesson difficult? Yes or no? Yes. Yes. Okay. So next time we can just read that story again. I really want us to practice our reading. Okay. Yes. Good work. Very good work today, though. Good job. All right. So I will see you next time. Okay. Have a good evening. Get some rest. And I will see you next time. Bye bye. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.